Okay, ladies and gentlemen, for our next video, we're looking at this weird little graph. Uh, we're answering domain and range only. Domain tells me to scan from left to right. Range tells me to scan from bottom to top. Domain is my X value. So, if I scan from left to right, my scan is starting here. And let's see, this is a negative 10, so negative 9, negative 8. So negative 7, let me make sure. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, six. yep. Okay, this x value is negative 7. So I'm scanning from here. This is where x is negative 7. And I'm scanning all the way. You know, don't worry about this in the graph because even though... I think this hole on course compass is going to look open and this hole is going to be closed. There's still not a gap there because the x value is not included here, but it is included here, so it makes up for that hole. So we just keep scanning and we scan till we get to that x value, which is negative 2. So I've scanned from left to right so far. I've gone from negative 7 to negative 2, and of course I'm going to put brackets because they're included. These, these endpoints are, you know, the value of negative 7 and negative 2 are included. And then I hop over, there's nothing that happens here. And my x value here looks like it starts at a positive 2, and I scan all the way over until I reach this x value which looks to me like it's a 9. Okay? So I'm going from 2 to 9, and that would be union from 2 included to 9 included. So the only part about this that's weird is that was a little hole, but it didn't matter because the x value that was left out there immediately got filled in right there. So you just scan from left to right. You scan from negative 7 to negative 2, then again from 2 to to 9. So that is our domain. Range, you scan from bottom to top. Okay, well let's see. The bottom y value is this one, and that would be negative 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, negative 8. Okay, so my bottom y value is negative 8. I just keep taking my pen and I scan as high as I can go. And so far, there's no break in the graph. I just keep scanning. I still see the graph all the way until I get up to here. And that's my top point. And that's a positive 9. So my graph from bottom to top scanned from negative 8. It scanned from negative 8 to positive 9. And that would be my answer for range. So again, domain, left to right range, bottom to top.